Hello, welcome back to Breaking Free from MPD with Lizzie. Thank you for you tuning in to my YouTube channel. If you are a new subscriber, welcome. Please like and subscribe. Please hit the bell icon to receive any of my upcoming videos. I hope that my content resonates with you. If you are already a subscriber, welcome back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Again, my name is Evangelist Lizzie Harrison. I am uh, the CEO and founder of Harrison Referral Services, a domestic violence organization. Uh, my YouTube channel is here to, re to help to rebuild and to restore hope, love, trust, and faith in Jesus, knowing all things are possible through Jesus. Amen. And so I want to invite you to come on in and spend some time with me as we talk about uh, narcissistic abuse, NPD, domestic violence, the new supply, uh, the push pull, gaslighting, uh, trauma bonding. We're going to be talking about all those different things. So welcome, welcome, welcome. I pray that my content resonates with you. Uh, again, I am not a doctor. Uh, I am not a, a therapist. Uh, I am a life coach, but at the same time, I am sharing uh, my personal testimony with you about what I've been through with the narcissist that I was with. And so this video today, uh, I'm going to be talking about violence free zone. And if you see I'm wearing my t-shirt, it says violence free zone. And so I am zero tolerance to violence of any time or any kind. And so I'm here today to share this video with you guys of you to tell the narcissist that was in your life or that's in your life of anybody that have tried to abuse you in any type of form or fashion. This, your body, your life, your space is a violent free zone. And so if anyone wants to come in and try to gaslight you, manipulate you, triangulate you with the new supply, if they want to verbally, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, psychologically, or sexually abuse you, you let them know that you have a violent free zone. Your body, your space, your atmosphere is violence free. And that they are not invited in any kind of way. You will not have them to distract you mentally, emotionally, spiritually, or psychologically. Because you are a child of God. And that no one can come in your space. No one can disrupt your, uh, 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 your flow that God has for you. And so even if you have been abused, if someone sexually abused you, mentally, emotionally, or psychologically, spiritually, economically, uh, whatever type, narcissistic abuse... Any type of form of fashion, you have to set your boundaries. Your boundaries are telling people that you are no longer going to be a target for abuse. You're no longer going to accept abuse. You're no longer going to be around abusive people. You're not even going to socialize with abusive people. And you're not even going to tolerate abuse against other people because you have a violent free zone. And so you can be healthy. You can be restored again. You can heal. And I also want you to know that, you know, you have to forgive uh, your abusers, you have to forgive those who abuse, but first of all, you got to forgive yourself for allowing yourself to be in these abusive relationships with these people. I don't care if the narcissist in your life was your mother, your father, your sister, your brother, your spouse, your co-worker, a neighbor or a friend. Abuse is abuse and it is zero tolerance. And if you notice that we're living in the last days and you know, with the pandemic and everything going on, you got people now are, are, are flipping off so quickly. They so easily um, triggered. They get upset really fast. People are uh, abusive. They're disrespectful. they rude. They lack empathy. Sounds like a narcissist, doesn't it? So what I'm telling you is that not all people are narcissists, but we are living in a narcissistic uh, society right now. And a narcissist, again, can be a male or female. So we're not talking about genders here or, or putting it on a particular gender, but you have male and female narcissists. But you want to be able to recognize when you are around abusive people, anyone that puts you down, make you feel bad, that don't celebrate you, you should always be celebrated. I was always told by my mentor uh, that he says, Liz, you know, you always go where you celebrate it and not where you tolerate it. We don't tolerate abuse because this is a violent free zone. We don't tolerate abuse. We don't tolerate disrespect anymore. We won't tolerate humiliation anymore. We won't tolerate anyone putting us down and, 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 and trampling upon our self-esteem. We will not allow it anymore. So I'm telling you today, 
This is 2020, but 2021 is coming. It's a new year and it's a new time. So I'm letting you all know, let anybody in your life know and that narcissist know that this is a violence-free zone and we will not tolerate it any longer. And that, again, that you are a man or a woman of God and, or, and a child of God. And you're not going to tolerate it anymore. So I am here to encourage you, to inspire you, to let you know that you do not have to tolerate abuse any longer. You are smart. You are loving. You are kind. You are compassionate. And there's somebody out there that's going to love you for who you are. And we don't have to accept secondhand. We don't have to accept uh, the disrespect. We don't have to accept that because there's a man or woman out there that God has for you that's going to love you for who you are. You're going to connect spiritually, mentally, emotionally, psychologically, and sexually. God is going to bring you all together. You just got to give yourself time. Let God choose your mate for you. Don't make the same mistake I made. I married someone that was totally not for me, even though I loved this person, this person did not love me. He abused me. He used me. He manipulated me. And now he triangulate, tried to triangulate me with this new supply. And that's another video I just recorded. So, but anyway, I just want to let you guys know that, you know, you're beautiful. You know, I'm a beautiful woman and I will not let anyone make me feel any less than that. I'm smart. I'm educated in the word of God. And, uh, I am a good mother. I'm a good friend. I'm a good per, uh, prayer partner. You know, I am a good uh, a community activist. I am good at everything that God has intended for me to be. So you are good as well. And so don't let anyone tell you anything different. So I'm going to let you know today, you let that abuser know that this is a no violence zone. It's a violence free zone and that your body, your mind, your personality and everything about you will no longer tolerate abuse. So I want to thank you so much for breaking free from NPD with Lizzie. Thank you so much for tuning in to my YouTube channel and to the next video. Again, I want you to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please, please hit the bell icon so you can receive any of my upcoming videos that I uh, upload. Again, please hit that like button so we can let the YouTube community know that the content that I'm sharing with you uh, is resonating with you or is helpful to you. But we have a lot of people out here that really need to hear this. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm just one of many channels out here that have awesome uh, YouTube channels and awesome programs, but I'm just here enjoying my freedom. I'm happy. I'm free from the narcissist. I can move on with my life. I can be what God intended for me to be. I don't have to be held back anymore because this is a violence-free zone. I am violence-free and I'm not going to tolerate any of it from anyone. So I want to encourage you today too that you don't have to tolerate any type of abuse at all. So again, until the next video, you have a wonderful, wonderful day or evening, whatever time it is for you around the world. You can also um, reach me if you want to contact me through warriorqueen.55 at yahoo.com. Again, that's warriorqueen.55 at yahoo.com. And don't forget to leave a comment down below. And if there's any particular topic that you want me to share or you want me to talk about, please leave it in the um in the content down below in the um comments and I will do a video on it. Okay. So you all pray for me as I continue to pray for you. But until the next video, you remain violence free and let the narcissist know that you will tolerate the violence. No more, no more triangulation, no more manipulation. You all have a good day.